We are here at Bits Power to check out some of the amazing products and builds that they have on display. Let's go check them out. This is the new lineup of CPU blocks from Bits Power. This is called the Summit LT. They use the same cold plate design as the bigger brother. However, they don't use as much material and cheaper material, so they're able to keep the price down. Now, each cap is completely removable and the RGB is actually built into the cap as well. So if you don't want to use RGB, you can leave it off. However, it is all magnetized in place as well. Uh, they're saying that they want users to be able to freely take that off paint it, customize it the way they like it. Today's video is brought to you by MSI and their line of X870 and B850 motherboards. Get DDR5 support of 8400 megahertz plus, PCIe 5.0 in next gen GPUs and M.2, and enjoy 40 gigabits per second standard with USB 4. Learn more in the link below. They'll be available for both Intel and AMD. They do have SKUs for both Intel and AMD, and we have no confirmation on pricing yet, but we are expecting availability pretty soon. This is the Summit Prime. This is what they call their Halo Prime product of their CPU water blocks. The beauty about these is customization is always taken into mind. So we can actually remove the covers. We have different covers available. We've got white, we've also got the frosted look. We've got a pure black and we've also got the silver look. The logos themselves can actually be removed as well. They are just magnetized in. And the beauty about that is when you have your CPU block installed, let's say you wanted to rotate it another 90 degrees, you can actually rotate the logo, whereas a lot of other companies, it's kind of stuck in place, then you can't rotate it. Or you can actually print out your own design and put it on the logo if that's what you like. The cover itself is actually magnetized into place and it does have implemented RGB into the block itself this time, not the actual cover plate. Again, they have a version for Intel. We also have AMD and we also have direct die at the moment for Intel. If there is popularity with this, they will be releasing an AMD version as well. There is no price confirmation yet, but it will be releasing very soon. This is actually the second generation of the Summit Revo. Uh, they call it the Mark II. It is essentially the stealth tubing option of their water blocks. This is the back of the motherboard here, the main tank where the liquid comes through from the front CPU block, and then the tubes run out and at the back of the PC. So if you want a cleaner build at the front, you don't want to see all the tubes, this could be the option for you. Now they do have both the AMD and the Intel version as well. Still not released yet on the market, but they are coming soon as well. Uh, pricing is to be confirmed. BitsPower wanted to add a little more aesthetic to their Hercules pump covers. And so what they've done is they've created these little backings on here, which are actually magnetized in. They will magnetize down on top of the screws and give that nice premium look to the cover. And the rotation can also be applied to this because it is also magnetized in as well. Not that you'll really see the logo because it's usually at the bottom of a reservoir, but it's just nice to have that feature just in case you decide to customize your build to the point where you actually do see this on display. We offered in black, white, white, gold, and silver. This is one of their distros that they have on offer with the brand new pump cover on their Hercules pump. The beauty about this distro is when you're doing your CPU or GPU loop and you want two nice parallel tube lines, you can actually move this up and down and then tighten it in place so that those lines are perfectly straight. A lot of the time users might have their tube line slightly out lining up with the ports, but this gives us a lot of flexibility when it comes to our tube runs. With the new lineup of 5000 series cards and even AMD cards on the market, it is very hard to get a GPU block to begin with. But now Bits Power has released all of their lineup of 5000 series GPU water blocks and AMD Radeon water blocks. Here we have a 5090 FE. We've also got a water block for the Astral. We've also got the Tough water block. And we do have the Gaming Trio and Supreme. All face plates on the water blocks are completely removable. So if you don't want the black design there, you can have a completely clear acrylic design. But if the black is your aesthetic, then leave that there for another nice clean design as well. All face plates are completely magnetized as well. So there's no screws needed to actually implement this in place. And if you want, you could actually paint this or 3D print some extras to put on top of it, make it your own. And the logo is completely removable as well. It is just magnetized in place. And again, depending on your layout in your build, you can actually rotate the logo. There it is, completely came off. 
it's magnetized. You can completely rotate it depending on the layout of your GPU. Bitspower has collaborated with Height for their Y70 case. They've released the dual distro. It's a dual loop, so you can have the CPU loop and the GPU loop. They've also got that piece of acrylic that you can actually bring up or down to line up your tube runs. It's got implemented RGB. It is two pieces of acrylic, but they've screwed it together to create one solid block. Implemented is also their Hercules pumps as well. And they've got this awesome design throughout. How sick is this build? This kind of reminds me of the Master Frame 700, but this is fully custom fully open loop, dual loop as well. They've got the Hercules pumps uh, with the FO120 uh, distros up the top here with the tubing going down. I love the pink and white design, fully customized open loop. It looks super sick. And they've done a good job hiding the cables as well with the cable covers running around to the back. Cable management at the back, considering it's an open build, looks really good. And we've got a dual 360 millimeter loop. The Bits Power products just always look super premium and super clean inside the custom PCs. We've got a Bits Power CPU block, Bits Power GPU block, and of course, all Bits Power fittings. I absolutely love this design. This is a Bits Power fully implemented into this open loop. Look at this, all the liquids just pouring down on this product. The hex reservoir is not even part of the loop, but it just looks so cool. I even love how they've rotated the motherboard on the angle here, and they've got the bits power GPU block set to gold. Uh, just really complements the rest of the theme there. And they've got the RGB at the back there, just a highlight down here. Really clean design. What do you guys think? Would you be too scared to have an open loop build on your desk? I know in Australia that would all probably evaporate in a day. Check out this custom piece of art here. I'm a bit worried that this thing's gonna fly away because we've got some sort of whatever that is uh, and the wings are going up and down. Like there's just so much engineering involved in this and it's absolutely incredible. They've also got a stealth block on there and, the, and a fully functioning water loop down below. It's just, amazing how they've done so well at hiding all of the cables. Check out this absolutely amazing steampunk build that has been put together. Absolutely incredible work. I really want to do a build like this again. Uh, we've done something similar before, but not as extreme. So I'd love to take it to the next level. Even the Wi-Fi sticks have been fully customized to fit that steampunk copper feel. And the whole water loop is all implemented in. And it also has that stealth tube water block on there. Even the cables themselves is just pure copper. Absolutely beautiful work there. And props to the modder. This is a mini D-frame PC build. We've got a one 20 res pump combo with the Hercules pump, Bits Power water block, Bits Power GPU water block. A lot of people don't actually realize that Bits Power have GPU water blocks on the market, guys. So go and check out their website if you're looking for a water block because they are so premium looking. And even the fittings as well, guys. This is a mini in-wind D-frame. Imagine trying to fly through the airport with this case. You would definitely be put on some sort of list. Nobody at the airport would know what this is, but this is a crazy dual-sided custom PC, and you really got to pay attention to cable management with an open build like this, and they've done such a fantastic job. It's implemented really nice. I love the chrome tubing that has been implemented in here. I think it just brings it all together. You can get that from Bits Power as well. Well, that's a wrap here at the Bits power booth. I have to say that my favorite product has to be the generation two of the stealth water blocks, but also the custom builds. I mean, you can't walk past them without dropping your jaw. They're absolutely incredible. Let me know, guys, if you want to see us attempt a steampunk build just like that in the comments. <laughs>